What's going on, Social Flare family? I want to show you how to use mass voting reactions. It is, you know, pretty updated, so I wanted to create that updated video for you guys. So let's go into mass voting reactions here. We want to make sure that our account is listed in this menu. If your account's not there, simply go up to dashboard, go to accounts, hit that guy with the little plus button on the very top, and then you're able to add that new account in right here. Once it's added, you should see it. When you go to accounts, you should see your account right here. So let's go down to automation. We're going to go all the way down to mass voting reactions. Then what we're going to do is we're going to select an account. Right here we have a little tutorial. That's the, um, the older version. We'll have a new one here. And what we want to do is we want to make sure that people followers is selected. And we have three more tabs here. So list target. We can actually add in a username. So how we want to do this is username, username, username. You can add, you want to have it like this, right? So you don't want the at sign at all. You just want, you know, a separate string um, returned or indented in. And I believe you can add up to like 10, 20 at a time. If it says error, just add less at a time. The next one is clear targets. So if you just want to erase all your targets, you would hit clear targets and then copy targets. You can just simply copy and paste these, put them in your notes, put them on other accounts, etc. cetera. Uh, so um, to start this, we want to make sure that, you know, people followers is selected. I wouldn't really go too far into the hashtags and places if you really want growth. If you want super quality and you want it super niche specific, then you can experiment with the hashtags and places. Uh, but when we go to the search, you just want to search up usernames. It's super simple. You can type in any username in your niche, whether it's business or modeling or makeup or fishing. We want to find usernames and then we're simply going to select them and you should see them pop up right here, which is a good sign. We have 46 targets here. We want to make sure polls is selected, poll sliders is selected, quiz is selected. Countdowns can be optional. Some people don't like countdowns because it kind of you know, um, spams out the notifications. So you could e either have that off or on. I like to just have it on because it's just another way to grow. We want to make sure answers is on and then we don't need to mess with anything else. We want to make sure that for you guys, it's going to say deactive. We need to make sure it's to active press save. We're not done yet. We need to add the custom response. So as you can see on the top, it says settings right to the right from that is answers. This is where we're gonna add our custom message. So we're gonna add a message like, I love you. You need to make, this is where most people go wrong, right? So so they have, um, they say, I love you or whatever their custom response is, and then they hit save. Don't do that, you need to hit add message. See where it says add message? Right above save, add message. And then if you scroll to the bottom, you're gonna start seeing everything get collected, and then you hit save. So if you want a new message, Hey, how are you? Obviously this grammar needs to be a lot better. How are you? Add message, right? So we added the message, then you hit save. And then you're gonna start seeing them collect right here. And then you can delete them if you want, just have the one that you want, hit save. So that is it for mass story reactions.